cell growth to confluence. Monitor cell cultures daily using an inverted phase microscope to assess the morphology and density of the cells. Another indicator of the culture's well-being is the color of the media if it contains the dye phenol red. Cultures become more acidic as cells grow due to an accumulation of lactic acid. A healthy culture is indicated by an orange color which is approximately equivalent to pH 7.2. This will slowly become more yellow as the cells respire and grow. Keep a record of name and reference number of the cell line, the medium components used and their batch numbers, dates on which the cells were split and or fed, passage numbers, cell counts, operator identity and a record of the laboratory and cabinet used. The life of a cell culture can be divided into four phases. Here we will look at the growth curve of a CHO cell line. You should be aware that other cell lines may grow at different rates. In the initial lag phase of the culture, cells are adapting to the culture conditions and the growth rate is less than optimal. During logarithmic or log phase, most of the cells are actively proliferating, resulting in an exponential increase in cell numbers. The latter stage of this phase provides the best conditions for subculture. Following this rapid cell growth, the rate of proliferation slows down and the cells reach plateau phase as they become confluent. Finally, there is a rapid death phase due to apoptosis as the culture depletes nutrients and toxins are accumulated. These images were acquired using an SN incusite. Section